In this video, I'm going to show you how to change the lock screen wallpaper on your Amazon Fire tablet. Hi, this is Justin from Simply Smart, where we make smart home technology as easy as one, two, three. So if you're interested in smart home technology, consider subscribing for more content like this. Also, if you're interested in building the ultimate smart home, check out the video description for the three simple steps to get started. Now what we're going to be doing in this video is we're going to be changing our lock screen wallpaper. So if I were to lock my screen right now, um, you can see that um, the wallpaper on my home screen and my lock screen is the same. Now also notice when I lock my screen, I do not have any ads. You have to remove the ads from your lock screen before trying to change the lock screen wallpaper because otherwise you're never going to be able to see the wallpaper because there will be ads on top of it all of the time. So I have videos on how to remove the ads from your Fire tablet. So check out the video description and get those ads removed first. Once you have your ads removed from your Amazon Fire tablet, what you need to do is go into the settings. So we're going to go into our settings and then we're going to go to display. And then right here we have wallpaper. So you can choose wallpaper. And then at the bottom you have different choices where you can choose any wallpaper that they have um, set up here. And there's a bunch of different ones, but there's not a ton of them. So what we wanna be able to do is we wanna be able to choose our own wallpaper. Notice in the photo section, we have an option to pick an image. So if we go into there, I've already added some of the these pictures here that we can use. Let's go ahead and choose um, this one here. And then I just click on the set button at the bottom. And now we go back out to our home screen. Now you can see that our wallpaper on our home screen has changed. And if we go over to our lock screen, you can see that the wallpaper is changed to the same as what it was on the home screen. So let's go ahead and go back in there. And we go to our Silk browser. And where you want to go is wall.alphacoders.com. If you just search for wallpaper abyss, um, you'll be able to find it as well. And they have 848,919 wallpapers. So you can go ahead and come into here and you can search for wallpapers. So I'm just gonna type in future search. So here we have some wallpapers that are future-esque. And let's go ahead and download this abstract futuristic one here. This one right here. And all you need to do is tap on the little blue arrow that's pointing down, and that's going to go ahead and download it. And now you can see that the file is downloading. So we've already downloaded our wallpaper. And now let's go back to the home screen and we go over to our settings again, go to display, tap on wallpaper and tap on pick an image at the left there. Now you can see that we do have this image here. Tap on that. Now we can make this our wallpaper. So we just go ahead and click set. And now if we go back out to our home screen, that is our wallpaper. And if we lock our tablet, that is our wallpaper. So that is how you would download a wallpaper, install it, get it working. But what if you wanted to have the wallpaper on your home screen be different than your lock screen. So I'm gonna show you now how to have a different image for your home screen and a different image for your lock screen on your Amazon Fire tablet. All right, so first what you need to do is you need to select a image that you want to use for your lock screen. So what we're going to be doing is we're gonna be going into our settings again and we're going to go to display and we're gonna choose wallpaper. All right, now let's go and pick a photo and let's go ahead and choose the image that we want to use. So I'm gonna go ahead and choose this image here and now we just need to scale this and click set. Now if we go back out to our home screen, that is our home screen wallpaper and if we lock our tablet, 
it is our lock screen wallpaper. So now what we need to do is make them different. And now we're gonna go into the App Store. All we need to do is tap on the search icon in the upper right and type in ES file. And it will be like one of the first things that pops up. Um, right at the top, you would be able to download it. So I've already downloaded it to make it a little bit faster. All you need to do is tap on open once you have downloaded the app. Now once in the app, you need to grant storage permissions. Just click on grant now and allow. And just click on start now at the bottom. Tap on the X in the upper right hand corner. And once in here, we just need to choose the image that we want to use for our home screen wallpaper. So we're gonna go to image from download, tap on that. We're gonna open the image. And in this case, what we're going to be doing is we're gonna open the image with the ES image browser. And we're just gonna say this time only, that way we get some options in the future. So we tap on this time only. And then what we need to do is we just need to go to the top of the screen, tap on the three little dots, and then what we need to do is click set background. So once we set background, it's going to give us an area to move around. So just get it the way you want it, and then at the bottom left corner, click on save. All right, now if we go back out to our home screen, now you can see we have that blue design in the background, and if we lock our tablet, we have the car on the lock screen. There's two other things that we probably want to do because you can see that we have the search and we have some notifications. So what we want is a very clean look. All we wanna see is our picture, the time, and some stuff in the upper right hand corner. So what we need to do is go into these settings and in here, let's go ahead and disable the search bar. So to do that, we go into our device options at the bottom here. And once in device options, you're going to see the search bar. And all we need to do is toggle that to be off. Now, if we lock our tablet, now you can see that the search bar is no longer there, but we still have all of these notifications. So we need to get rid of these notifications and we need to go back out of device options and we want to go into apps and notifications at the top. Now, once in there, we want to go to notifications on for all apps, just tap that. And what we want to do is where it says on lock screen, show all notification content, tap on that and do not show notifications at all. Now there's one other thing that I like to do. See um, up at the top of my screen where it has like a camera icon, triangle with an exclamation point and a check mark with a line. I like to put all of those into one. So I'm gonna turn on at the bottom here, collapse notifications. Now you can see it just has a five in a white circle and it's a much cleaner look. All right, so now we are done here. We can tap on the home button so now we have our background for our home. And if we lock our tablet, we have our background for our lock screen. And notice it is so clean and so nice looking. Now we don't have to worry about any notifications and no search bar. And we can have it different than our home screen wallpaper. Now also, if you change the orientation of your tablet, now the car looks much better on our lock screen. So that is all you have to do to change your lock screen wallpaper on your Amazon Fire tablet. So I hope you found that video helpful. If you did, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. If you have any questions or have any problems, leave a comment, and I will see you in the next video.